Okay, here's how to add a new module or edit an, an existing module. Uh, a module is this area here. This menu is a module and this login form is a module and this graphic is a module. So basically you can have anything in this position here. This is also a module position, a module position. Um, a lot of sites have module positions on the right. So basically it's like adding a little page but with something specific in it. Uh, now let's demonstrate. So go to the back end of the website, go to extensions, module manager, and there you can see all the various modules. The red ones are the ones that are turned off, not visible at all, and the ticks are the ones that are visible. Okay, so we now go to new, and it'll bring up a little page with a whole bunch of uh, pre-made modules. So example is the menu is pre-made, um, the login is pre-made, this is a custom one, which is just a graphic. We can see by scrolling our mouse over it that it's just a graphic there, nothing else. Um, so if we want to just add an image or some text, then we would just select custom HTML. The page will load up, in this case slowly, but surely. There we go. Okay, first of all, put in a title. So, test module. Um, you can either show the title, which will be this, or not show the title. In this case, we will. We want it enabled. We want it on. We want it to be in the left position. These are various other positions. You'll be given a map to show you uh, where uh, your module positions are for your particular site. Here you can select it to be on all pages or no pages or there is reasons why you have it on no pages by the way but that's another story. We'll go into that into the more advanced steps. Um, or you can select a page. So let's say if we just want it on the typography page then we would just select it. If you hold down Alt and then select you can select others as well. However if we just want one we could do that and then we put in test 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 blah 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 okay we can put in images etc but we won't go into that right now press apply go back to the front end a refresh now we won't see it because we selected this page for it to be on we select that page and there we go test module and there it is. Uh, now if you would like to rearrange it, let's say if we want it up the top there, then we go here, back to the back end, and then we can go order, and then main menu, press apply, and refresh. Now if you want it to go to the top, it won't always go to the top. In this case it did. Sometimes it won't. Uh, sometimes it will sit underneath the top one, because we selected the top one. Uh, sometimes it won't, there are various reasons why, but all you need to know is um, if it doesn't go, then all we've got to do is press save. Uh, so if it is sitting underneath this main menu, then all we would do is just move it up uh, manually by selecting these arrows, so up or down. Uh, and then you can see it's on top of this one, so if we want it to be under it, then we would just go down or if we wanted it to be over it we would go up and refresh and there you have it moving and creating a module position